कौन नकली कौन फर्जी का दमदार ट्रेलर हुआ लॉन्च शाहिद कपूर विजय सेतुपति अमोल पालेकर पूरे स्टार कास्ट ने कही ये बात चलिए हमारे कुछ दोस्त हैं जो सवाल लेके तैयार हैं आई बिलीव यू ऑलरेडी सेंट इन योर क्वेश्चंस एंड सबसे पहले नवीन फ्रॉम न्यूज 24 हाय नवीन डू यू हैव अ माइक ऑलरेडी एंड आर यू हियर विद अस ऑल राइट नवीन आई बिलीव यू हैव अ क्वेश्चन फॉर शाहिद और या आई हैव अ क्वेश्चन फॉर राज एंड डीके हाय सबसे पहले तो ट्रेलर बहुत ही पसंद आया हम लोगों को एंड वी वर वॉट वेटिंग फॉर इट जिस तरह से शाहिद ने पहले दिन जब अमेजॉन प्राइम के बहुत सारे फिल्मों का अनाउंसमेंट हुआ था उस वक्त जो हमारा एक्साइटमेंट था वही एक्साइटमेंट आज भी है एंड ये ट्रेलर बहुत ही जानदार था मेरा सवाल राज एंड डी के से है कि जो भी चीज़ें आप बनाते हैं उसके हमने देखे हैं कि उसके मीम्स भी बनते हैं आगे चल के तो क्या आपने इसमें कॉन्शियसली रखा था कि कुछ ऐसी चीज़ें रखा जाए जिसके आगे चल के मीम्स भी बनने वाले बिकॉज वी लव डेट एंड वी आर वेटिंग फॉर इट सच बताए तो नॉट रियली यू कैन मेक अ सीरीज स्पेशली विद मीम्स इन माइंड बिकॉज you know there's so much to write and you get trapped into those little things but what did happen when the trailer was uh, being shown is somebody pointed out uh, that uh, every line in the trailer seems to be a meme so that was pretty funny that every line could be a meme so yeah sure i'll see some memes if possible Our next question, of course, Bhavna. Bhavna, you here? Okay, we have a question from Bhavna for Shahid. Okay. So, should I ask her question, or does somebody else? Okay. So, Bhavna has put a placeholder for you, Shahid. Clearly, big fan. Uh, what is the kind of prep that you've done for Farzi? Any workshops? and now that you forayed into the long format digital space is there any difference between shooting for a film and shooting for a web series oh <laughs> uh, well um bhavna's in the loop uh, but if you can hear me bhavna here's my answer um but you know the way this show happened was that uh, rajan dk had uh, I kind of pounced on them and asked them what they have. So I don't think they officially came to me ready to offer me a show. I guess they were in the process of developing it, and that's when I showed interest in wanting to do something with them on OTT. And then they said that they have the show, and then we kind of spent, I think, five or six months talking about the show. They would take me through it at various stages, whether they liked it or not. I would give my feedback. And <laughs> uh, what happened by the time we reached the set is that I didn't feel like an actor who. steps into a role maybe a couple of weeks before preps for about a week has three meetings and feels he owns it i don't like doing that anymore i feel that's very pompous i think it's much nicer to try and become a part of the team if you want to have a voice it shouldn't be just because you're the star of the show it should be because you're as much a team member as everybody else and uh, i wanted to do that on this show so we actually spent a lot of time talking to each other discussing the character the various facets of the character the entire angle of sunny being an artist and that being the face of his character like if you see in the promotion also it's very much you know the artistic energy of sunny it has been pushed out a lot uh, you know and i all that happened while we were talking and discussing about how to make it different and fresh and unpredictable and um so i vetted myself in that journey um the rest of it you know all my mumbaiyanes came out just when i met this bugger when he when he came on set and he started you know feroz and he's got this accent he talks and i bought other other i was like okay i remember that when i was 18 years old you know and going in the train for my shamak dawar classes you know that that was the bunch of boys that i used to hang with and that was the underbelly of mumbai that i you know i was a part of that you know when i was living that middle class normal youngster wanting to do something in life a lot of it came from the conversations a lot of it came from my co-actors and the people that i worked with um and i don't really have a process i'm very instinctive and organic about how i like to do it is she back from the bathroom <laughs> or should i keep going till she it's a long break we're recording it oh. show it to bhavna usko bathroom mein dikha do 
you know you know i do want to ask her second part of that question the difference between uh, you know a film and a long format what was it like for you you have to delve deeper um there is more opportunity as an actor to bring more to it um i think when you're doing something short format you can be more attacking in the way that you approach the character sometimes that works very well i have seen that i've never been a fan of that i don't like attacking characters i like to pull people into the into the screen you know i feel like it should be immersive um so this actually really suits me because that immersive experience is what i enjoy as a viewer and as an actor also that's that comes very naturally to me i want people to kind of get engaged and involved as opposed to shouting and telling them to give me attention it's not my thing um so this allowed me to do that you know and i and i love long format for that very reason i probably consume more in terms of hours on long format than i have in a film theater in the last couple of years for various reasons um so i felt very comfortable and i was actually looking forward to the opportunity thank you so much our next question at this point rama rama say something yeah. yes thank you uh so question one question each for makkal selvan and aparna in the series la ningu tamil la dialogues iruka illa hindi la da pesreenga illa idle sir i am a tamil guy in the, i am a tamil guy in the series i speak here and there only maybe five six words that's all uh, but generally i speak in hindi only fully tamil la ningu dub panni illa nakka sir i didn't get time sir <laughs> i was continuous i have a shoot sir, so i didn't get time sir neram kadikala thorndu shoot irundhala enal panna mudiyala na nala sonna na ina romba neram aagum or series fulla dub pandrathukku so adu eight episodes dub pannu endra adu neram illa so anala naan mannippu kettukonde mannikku illa illa ina your own audience vandu tamil la ungala adha sir unma da sir ana அதை எதிர்பார்க்கல அதனால முடியாமல் போயிடுச்சு வேற ஒன்றும் இல்லை அச்சா அப்புறம் நான் கேச கரலேத்தையும் ஆப் மதலப் ஏக் ஷோ ஆயா பலா ஷோ ஆயா ஃபிர் சே ராஜ் ஆர் டிகே கோ லேக்கர் ஆய ஆப் ஓ பி ஃபேமிலி மேன் பி எஃப் சே ஷுரூ ஹோத்தா ஹே ஃபர்ஸி பி எஃப் சே ஹீ ஷுரூ ஹோத்தா ஹே ஹவு டு யூ கம் அப் வித் சச் அண்ட் ஆன் சம்பிள் காஸ் எவ்ரி டைம் அண்ட் இட்ஸ் பேன் இண்டியா காஸ் எவ்ரி டைம் தட் யூ கைஸ் டூ இட் i like i was uh, saying my job is to constantly be on a lookout for uh, good stories stories that are differentiated and compelling and exciting and uh, i think by now we have a relationship as rajan dk were mentioning earlier uh, we constantly talking to each other uh, finding out what's brewing in their head uh, but really you know our job is to constantly look for stories and i have always said that stories that are in the hands of really really passionate creators if you have that half your job is done and once you have a great story once you have a story which is as compelling as this uh, no actor would like to say no to it as we've just heard it's really the it's the story that we go for thank you so much for that i hope you're happy what happened to your finger ओह मुझे पता है आप इतने स्मार्ट हो अगला सवाल इतना कूल है इनका ये मिडिल फिंगर आप दिखाओ ना एक बार मैंने ये ना मेरा मिडिल फिंगर के साथ कुछ पुराना रिश्ता है मैं कई बार दिखा चुका हूं मिडिल फिंगर क्लास है आप Well, right, Rashi, question for you, and this one is, of course, coming to you from Dina Malar. Minakshi wants to ask you this question. Uh, talk to us about your on-screen persona and what it is like. What is doing in a crime thriller show, and of course, you know how do you how you built it? So, um, as I spoke about my character Megha, she is an epitome of a modern woman uh, in a man's world, and um, for me, half the job was done. because of the way it was written the layers that it was given and i just had to come and play that part and i think honestly i really want to thank rajan dk sir for presenting me the way that they've presented me because i don't think i have um played such a character ever before that is so raw relatable passionate extremely real that is why i said that you will probably you will you will root for her 
and you will be happy when in her small victories. So yes, I think it will definitely create a shift in the way the audience has seen me even back in the South. So that's an added cap and I'm very, very happy to have played her. Thank you. So am I. Thank you. Congratulations again. Tanmay, you have a question? Uh, so Shan, I have a question for you. Yes. Uh, so on Amazon, I'll have up the music game with Majama and other shows and films. So uh, as Farzi is also a, a, has a racy music. So uh, what's your future plan in terms of music for the series, shows, films? I think our job first and foremost is finding, as Apanna said, finding great storytellers who are looking to tell a great story and really enabling them. So we don't think of, we think of music as how can this help further the story itself and how we narrate the story. So it's really, it's really integral to how we talk about developing a show, working with creators like Raj and DK. Uh, it, you know, as long as we find great stories and if music is inherent to how the story can be progressed, uh, we love it. And as you said, we have, had, we have had some amazing shows and movies over the years on Prime Video that have had music as an integral part and that's really helped them. Uh, and that's really helped audiences uh, as well. So, uh, you know, we are big on it and I must say it again because you said it, the music in Z is absolutely smashing. Thank you so much. Let me add to that. Bandish Bandits, Majama, Modern Love, Four More Shots. You guys are not stopping, huh? So, congratulations. Thank you. All right, Shad, there's a question for you. Hopefully, Farzi is not here. Shivoji is here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Aray, wow, That's miracle. Okay. Uh, team is fantastic and I think it's uh, really OG content coming from you guys. Uh, so first of all, congratulations. Uh, I am Shubhajit from IWM Buzz. My question is to Shahid. I think you mentioned some time back that uh, the, uh, the concept had come to you eight years back. Uh, and at that point of time, you didn't really, ha like the bandwidth for making it into a web series wasn't really there because the concept only was not in that favor. Now you can do it. Uh, so eight years is, is actually quite a long time. You know, the world has changed in terms of COVID and all. So I'm sure in terms of ideations as well, a lot of new things have been incorporated in the project. So what are those new things and elements that you have had to do because of that eight years gap? And also what were your preparations uh, for this? Are you asking me how the story kind of evolved and changed over the period of time? Yes. I think that question would be better for Raj and DK because they've developed it. I had the good fortune of hearing most of it. So, would you guys want to? Um, yeah, I mean, um, see, the, when, we, when we were writing the initial uh, script itself, we knew it was too big a world we were taking on. And there was only one format, feature films, and we are feature filmmakers. So, any story we have, we get, you know, Sita and Suman, when we discuss, we come up with an idea, it automatically tries to fit it into a feature film. That's what we were trying to do. Uh, but, you know, uh, thankfully, it, there, there is a, a much bigger window the last few years where we can express or narrate a story much uh, wider, deeper, longer, more layered. So hence, I think this is a much better fit for this story. Yeah, and uh, speaking of how the story would have adapted over the years, a lot of things have changed. So a strange anecdote for us, at one point when we were uh, back, back in mid-2000, around 2014 or so, we had this idea in the story that the only way to battle counterfeiting is to uh, invalidate these notes. And so we had this plot point in it. And then guess what happened two years later? That happened in real life. And we we're like, okay, maybe that's a sign. Now we should go relook at the script and start you know, incorporating that part of it into our story. So it kind of, uh, uh, it kind of became like a art meets reality meets art kind of a scenario. Shai, do you want to add about your preparations? I kind of already spoke to Bhavna while she was in the loo regarding my preparations. Maybe you were also in the loo. Uh, but uh, like I said, I, I spent a lot of time with them talking about the content. And, and you know, for me, a lot of the preparation happens in those conversations. And I like to engage as early as possible in case I have the opportunity. And uh, doing different types of content. I mean, I was doing Kamine in 2007, 2008. You know, so I'm always looking for content which is different um, and not necessarily boxed into being, you know, the mainstream, typical, commercial, boring, nothing excited about it kind of. I'm always looking to do something which kind of, kind of shakes it up and this was totally up, up that uh, alley. So I just jumped on it, man. All the best. Thank you so much. Thank you. Aditi from News 18, are you with us? I can't. 
you want to say something on a mic yeah, yeah, yeah. don't tap it just say something into hello. it hello yeah wonderful hi hi amol sir this side yeah i'm aditi from news 18 sir so, want to stand up yeah. so here yeah. yeah so you know you will be seen on the screen after a really long time so kaisa tha overall experience and as shahid and rashi earlier mentioned that you are the heart of the show so please talk to us about it it's very uh, very kind of all of them to say that i am heart of the show <laughs> but uh, actually mine is a almost like a guest appearance having said that what what was fascinating to watch and to be part of the whole shooting process was <clears throat> dk and raj i have noticed even in the past and while shooting i noticed it even more you know they are creating something larger than life they are creating something which is a heightened drama and to sustain it for such a long time requires a complete command over the craft but the interesting part of it was while creating the heightened drama everybody the performances and everything was not heightened all the characters all the performances are when you see the actual product you will realize that what is usually called as underacting everybody is underacting and that combination of a heightened drama with underacting is so fascinating and i thoroughly enjoyed that because i think that's my turf no and because you taught us this let's not shy away from that thank you you gave us this language in cinema so thank you sir for that and thank you he, i'm sorry i'm like to add to it uh, he said he is uh, he has a guest appearance in the show i feel he has the guest of honor appearance it, oh. it seats everything yes. can i add to that thank you so much because we're having fun guest appearance nahi best appearance hai wo yaad rakhega hi shahid aapke theek samne hi hi madam hi sir go for it try hi shahid shahid uh, इन दिनों हमारी मार्केट में बहुत सारे फर्जी एक्टर आ गए जो हुबू आपकी तरह दिखते हैं और आपकी तरह उनके बाल हैं हेयर स्टाइल हैं आपकी तरह वो वीडियो बनाते हैं और बहुत सारा फर्जी पैसा कमाते हैं तो ऐसे लोगों के लिए शाहिद क्या कहेंगे हम लोग ने बहुत सारे काउंटर फीट नोट बनाए हैं इस फिल्म के अंदर उन सबको आप वो नोट्स भेज सकते हैं <laughs> रियल शायद फिलहाल मैं फर्जी हूं ब्रदर टेंथ फेब तक मैं फर्जी हूं और ऐसा कौन नहीं दिखना चाहेगा ये भी तो बात है सर ऐसा कौन नहीं दिखना चाहेगा ये भी तो बात है कौन नहीं दिखना चाहेगा कोई नहीं ऐसा जो नहीं दिखना चाहेगा गुड एनीबडी शाहिद हाय हाय मैम यस जरा इनकी माइक हेलो 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 नमस्कार माझा प्रश्न अमोल सरांना आहे ट्रेलर खूप छान झालाय सगळ्या टीमचं अभिनंदन खरतर सर तुम्ही मगाशी म्हणालात की शाहिद आणि तुम्ही खूप छान काम केलंय किंवा तुम्ही खूप गप्पा मारायचात तुमचं आणि शाहिदचं कधी मराठी संभाषण झालंय का सेटवर ह्याचं उत्तर शाहिदने पण द्यावं असं मला वाटतं नाही मराठीत संभाषण नाही झालं पण आम्ही एकाच पद्धतीची भाषा बोलतो हे जे मी म्हटलं त्याची ऍक्टिंग स्टाईल माझी ऍक्टिंग स्टाईल आणि सगळ्यांचीच ऍक्टिंगचं जे टेक्स्चर आहे ते एकच आहे त्यामुळे आमचा जो डायलॉग असायचा तो त्या लेवलचा असायचा अँड इट वॉज अ प्लेजर आणि शाहीद तुला काय मराठीत बोलायचं आहे का कारण का मराठी देखील पत्रकार आहे सो तुला मराठीत काय बोलायचं आहे मुझे अभि मराठी मे बोलना येस यार तू बोलते ती पहिले मी प्रिपेअर करके आ जाता मेरे साथ दो तीन घंटा बिता लेती मी तिरसी नोट्स लेता सारे अभि मुझे क्यू फसा रही आहे मत कर यार 
but it's beautiful right one stage we heard tamil we're hearing hearing marathi we're hearing english hindi this is truly what they call pan india this is that show guys this I mean, is that I mean, show can we Woo-hoo. talk in telugu as well and telugu as well yes. fantastic all right there's another question oh you have a mic yes sir bolena shahid your center rahul here from the filmi chacha uh, mera sawal rashi se bhi aur aap se bhi common question hai sabse pehle to aapke 20 saal pure ho chuke hain film industry mein aur rashi ke 10 saal वो मेरे दस हो ही नहीं है बट ठीक है मद्रास कैफे ऐसे बोल देता यार तू कि आपने बीस साल पूरे करे थे आज आपके बीस साल पूरे हो चुके हैं <laughs> आप पुराने हो ओ, चुके हैं सवाल ये था कि इतने सालों का एक्सपीरियंस रहा है और हम आज सब लोग फर्जी के ट्रेल लॉन्च पे पहुंचे हैं फर्जी की बात हो रही है तो फर्ज के बारे में बात न करे तो फर्जी बुरा मान जाएगी तो इतने सालों के एक्सपीरियंस में किस तरह का कोई कभी नाता रहा है आपका फर्ज और फर्जी दोनों का कुछ एक्सपीरियंस आपका राशि आप भी कभी फर्ज से पाला पड़ा हो या फर्जी से फर्ज से पाला हाँ मतलब फर्ज से हुआ था इस तरह का कोई भी फर्ज फर्जी से पाला जी दोनों से इन वर्ड से जी पाला? जी <laughs> कभी वार्तालाप हुआ ऐसा कभी फर्ज निभाने का मौका मिला हो बहुत कॉम्प्लेक्स क्वेश्चन है हमारा शो भी ऐसी डीप कॉम्प्लेक्स मल्टी डिमेंशनल है मुझे कुछ समझ में नहीं आ रहा है कुछ बोलना चाहेंगे आप फर्ज के बारे में फर्ज का मतलब ड्यूटी होता है जी, जी, जो, भी, में। जो भी हमारे रिश्ते नाते होते हैं जिंदगी में उनकी तरफ हमें अपनी ड्यूटी निभानी होती है कर्मा धर्मा वही होता है ना कर्म से रिलेशंस मिलते हैं और रिलेशंस की तरफ आपका धर्म होता है तो ये हो गया फर्ज का और फर्जी कभी फील हो इंडस्ट्री में कि फर्जी कुछ ऐसा फर्जी कुछ ऐसा मतलब क्या फर्जी है कभी ऐसा लगा हो एक्सपीरियंस में कभी कि मेरे साथ फर्जी हो गया या मैंने किसी के साथ कर दिया मेरे मैंने किसी के साथ फर्जी कर दिया ऐसा कभी एक तो फर्जी वर्ड ऐसे सेंटेंस में कभी यूज नहीं होता है कि फर्जी हो गया फर्जी कर दिया फर्जी एक चीज होती है दिस दिस थिंग इज नॉट रियल तो ऐसा कुछ हुआ हो जो नॉट रियल है बीस साल से हम नॉट रियल फिल्में बना रहे हैं और लोग उसे रियल मारने थे इससे ज्यादा क्या फर्जी हो सकता है देखिए शायद ने आपको जवाब दे दिया अभी इसमें मैं क्या ऐड कर सकती हूँ नहीं आप दस साल पुरानी हो गई हैं कुछ बताइए उनको इसके बारे में देखिए फर्स्ट तो ऑफ कोर्स फर्स्ट तो फर्स्ट योर ड्यूटी टुवर्ड्स योर फैमिली टुवर्ड्स एवरीबॉडी आई डोंट नो व्हाट यू मीन बाय फर्ज रियली आई मीन दैट्स द डेफिनेशन ऑफ इट फर्जी इज एज ई सेट इज अ थिंग कुछ फर्जी है तो आई डोंट नो द रिलेशनशिप आई एम नॉट अंडरस्टैंडिंग वॉट टू से इन दिस कुछ ऐसे मतलब कभी तुमने एक नकली फर्जी विग पहन ली हो या कोई ऐसे फेक टाइप का फर्जी आदमी तुम्हारी लाइफ में आ गया हो उसका आज मूड है वो इस मूड में आया कि मैं ऐसा कुछ सवाल पूछूंगा लॉजिक के पीछे मत भागो मूड समझो इंसान का our farz our duty is to give 100% in whatever we are giving whatever we are doing and farzi is not doing that wow, wow. <laughs> last two questions Hello. at this point Moini, hi pooja you from awesome tv pooja hi. i was missing you yeah miss you too yeah pooja who is your question for for bhuvan firstly congratulations to the entire team Thank the you. trailer looks simply awesome Bhuvan, uh, you. you know, जब दोस्ती की बात होती है तो we we all have a friend जिसके साथ हम क्राइम करते हैं एंड दैट्स वाई वी कॉल पार्टनर इन क्राइम तो आपकी शाहिद के साथ ऐसी ही कुछ बॉन्डिंग नजर आ रही है सो टेल समथिंग अबाउट योर केमिस्ट्री विद शाहिद बिकॉज यू आर प्लेइंग पार्टनर इन क्राइम सो आयरोनिकली आपने हिंदी में सवाल पूछा तो मैं हिंदी में जवाब देता हूँ uh, ये पहली बार नहीं है जब शाहिद भाई और मैं मिल रहे हैं uh, मुझे याद है मैं बैक इन द डे एफ टी आई में पढ़ता था जब तो मैं नया नया मेरा एडमिशन हुआ था और मेरी रैगिंग चल रही थी हेल्दी रैगिंग और सर वहाँ पे कमीने शूट करने आए थे इनकी फिल्म और मेरी पूरी रैगिंग इन्होंने पीछे खड़े होके देखी तो मुझे जब मैं इनसे पहली बार मिला तो मैंने बोला कि भाई वे मेड बिफोर तो इन्होंने पहले मुझे जैसे बोला ऑफकोर्स ड्रो ऑफकोर्स तो मैंने बोला आपको लेकिन याद नहीं होगा मैंने बोला नहीं नहीं मुझे याद है मैंने कहा अच्छा कहाँ मिले तो बोला कि <laughs> मैंने बोला कि आपने मेरी रैगिंग पूरी एनकाउंटर की थी और आपने पूरे मजे लिए थे इसके एंड आई स्टिल रिमेंबर फर्स्ट डे ऑन द सेट आई रिक्वेस्टेड हिम लिटरली आई सेट कि भाई आप जो भी करेंगे यू आर मच मोर एक्सपीरियंस देन मी आपको मुझसे बहुत ज़्यादा पता है चीज़ों के बारे में और uh, अगर आपको कहीं पे लगता है कि मैं गलत हूँ 
सो डोंट हेजिटेट टू स्कोल्ड मी डोंट हेजिटेट कुछ भी बोलने में मैं बिल्कुल बुरा नहीं मानूंगा और प्लीज़ मुझे आप अपने छोटे भाई की तरह समझिए आप मुझे समझिए कि आप ईशान के साथ शूट कर रहे हैं एग्जैक्टली exactly मैंने ये वर्ड्स बोले थे शायद भाई को एंड आई एम रियली रियली थैंकफुल ही ओब्लाइज और आज तक मुझे अभी भी याद है कि एक दिन तो इस नौबत पर आ गई थी जब मेरे गाल पर मेकअप ठीक नहीं हो रहा था तो इन्होंने ब्रश हाथ से लेकर खुद से मेकअप करना शुरू कर दिया सो ही वॉज सो केयरिंग एंड सो ही ऑलवेज हैज वॉच आउट फॉर मी एंड टिल डेट इफ आई फील दैट आई एम अ लिट क्लू लेस मेरे को किसी चीज़ को लेकर समझ में नहीं आ रहा नॉट जस्ट अबाउट द शो I think that I share that bond with them, that relationship with them, where I can, you know, just message him and I call him and ki bhai, I'm here to fuss you. Tell me, tell me, I'm what to do. And he still answers and he still, you know, gives me the right guidance, which I feel I'm really, really blessed to have uh, an elder brother figure in Shahid Bhai. And yeah. Baki. Thanks, thanks, Bhuvan. Thank you so much. There's a question for Vijay sir at this point. from screen graphia just want to know that i had seen all your films uh, solo single handedly uh, you had carried the films very well on the box office success also says the same but when you go for a multi uh, star cast or maybe for a parallel lead uh, do you, don't you feel insecure what thought process do you have when you go for those kind of roles see uh, the films i have acted there are so many actors that is also multi stars only so we are comparing only the other stars and multi stars who actors i respect amul sir and then and i saw from buans work so he is also very good actor so not only shagir so i so there are lot of actors and then i become a and then art is a place we are where we are not here to compete with uh, with our co actors we are just collaborating and working so it is not a win win situations no that is no it's a sharing and learning and that's how life should be that's why i don't believe in winning a competition i like a game i don't want the game should be an end life that's so it's like playing a game is interesting it's a winning or losing it it'll end the game so that's how i believe then i was a hero in 2010 and then i was doing my film called nadula konja pakkatha one pizza that time one of uh, 96 uh, director prem was doing a film with the actor called sasik mazhar so they need a character for a villain so i recommended a few of my friends who tried chances with me they don't like them and then uh, i said narrate a story to me if i like it i'll come and do it for you so that was my third film and even the director asked me really you want to do already did three films so i didn't have second security that time also when i was entering in the film so so i i never had that uh, insecurity with anybody because i want to work with super fantastic very talented actors so that i can learn so everything you can learn and come it's like it's like life is in a throwing an experience ball you just throw and the heel throw you that it's like sharing your thoughts so i so i love to work with the quarter film with multi stars and i did so many multi stars films also so i love working and i enjoy it thanks thank you so much for your questions uh, you've been a wonderful audience at this point of course thank you and wish you all the best for farzi 10th of february it's going to be a party guys congratulations i'd like of course to request our friends from the press you know one more opportunity for photographs so could i please request my star cast to kindly step forward Fuzzy on the tenth of Feb, only on Prime Video. Salah, yete mi, beto ya, namaskar, bye bye, good night.